Um, what were your favorite, favorite memories? Were they, were they holidays? Uh, I remember my dad was Barbecue King, and that was his last name, actually. <laughs> and he barbecued year round. Um, he, he would even set up, you know, set the barbecue. Somebody built him one out of a 55 gallon drum. And uh, he would stand out in the garage, and, you know, if it was snowing or whatever, he'd stand out there and didn't matter, rain, snow, shine, whatever. He even, he'd even put seafood on the <laughs> grill. He, and we had parties, barbecue parties all the time. Relatives, we had a lot of friends. We had relatives in town that, uh, and we had several family reunions out in the backyard and out here. We'd set up tables and just a lot, a lot of, we have, we're lucky, we're blessed to have a very loving family. We're all very close, still are. So this was like the family hub, right? Yes. Yep, That's it awesome. was. Mm -hmm. His brothers would come from Tennessee. That's when they did stay downstairs. They had beds, you know, mom would set up. Um, uh, but we had relatives that have come in from one end of, from Washington to North Carolina. So, and all in between. When you walk into the kitchen, is there any memories that come? Yeah, oh yes, lots of them. My mom was a fabulous cook, and she cooked for, you know, not only us, but a lot of other people she would take dishes to, and we traded dishes with next door. <laughs> and uh, my middle sister is the one that took to cooking. She got into 4-H, and she, uh, she's a really good cook, too. She still is. And everyone looked forward to her when she was, she'd come into town when we were taking care of mom the last years and she'd come in three or four times from Tennessee and stay a month and cook for her son who is here and another nephew. They were always over here for her cooking too and cook for mom. So mom passed that down. We all can cook, but mom and my sister are the queens <laughs> and my dad. Yeah. If this house could Oh, it would talk about all the fun and love. We had a wonderful life here. We really did. I, <laughs> I will miss it. Um, yeah, our folks taught us uh, uh, the most important things in life aren't money and aren't, <laughs> you know, they, they set us up with very good morals. Um, I have to laugh. One thing we talk about how nice this porch is but I remember one bad memory where that porch light, when we were dating, when we started dating, that porch light was on and it was like a beacon for the entire Elk Street. And that's, you know, they, they made sure we were good girls. 